Still not the science guy. Do, 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 do. Hey, what up, YouTube, YouTube? Welcome back to Dill Nye the Science Guy with me, Dill Nye. Today, we're going to be doing a how-to vlog. So I'm gonna show you how to build a circuit system. Ooh, I know, sounds pretty spooky, dealing with electricity. So let's try not to get electrocuted. First things first, let me show you what we're gonna be building. I'm calling this a paper circuit because it's literally just a circuit made on a piece of paper. All right, so what even is a circuit? A circuit is a path for energy to flow through, and you can have them both in series and parallel. Here are some diagrams to check out. A series circuit means that all of the components are connected along a single path, so the same current flows through all of the components. A parallel circuit means the components are connected along different paths, and the current flows through both of these path systems. Now let's get building! First we'll start with a paper circuit build without the paper clip switch in it because it's a simpler build. You will need cardstock, copper tape, electrical tape, scissors, a coin cell battery, and a 10 millimeter LED. So first we're going to lay down the copper tape and make sure that when you're building the circuit, the copper tape goes on both sides of all of the elements to ensure that the electricity is conducted and current can flow through the circuit. You'll also want to make sure that when you're building this, that the positive side of the battery should connect to the longer leg of the LED. Otherwise, the circuit will not be completed. Here's the circuit with the paper clip switch added. Make sure that it's completely covered in copper tape to conduct electricity properly. And then, of course, don't forget to try this on your own. Building the circuit was really fun for me to do, and it's really practical in in-life applications. So, per usual, don't forget to tune in next time, like, subscribe, and leave any questions in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.